away the deep pass on the outside and made TSU matriculate down the middle of the field. And that's made it very difficult for the Tigers. Andrew Body, freshman quarterback, slings it off to the right. Catch made. Hard oh, tackle wow. with a 32-yard line. Heard that one up here in the booth on the third level. Kevin Harris. Harris. The running back with the catch. A little crunch time action there on the sideline. A little game we used to play when we played street ball. But another big hit. My goodness. What was the game you'd play? The loudest hit wins? Or? <laughs> I was sticking on the sideline. So you're touching the street, and then when you get to the grass, that's when you can hit You can hit the runner. That's when we played, this, when we played street ball as kids, and that's what Alcorn's out here playing right now. Well, great to see if you're Fred McNair and this coaching staff, the defensive coordinator Cedric Thornton, they're up 17, but they, I think they've ratcheted up the intensity. It's a veteran team, six straight East Division titles in the SWAC before they sat out last year. And here they are, really smelling blood in the water, trying to close out this game on the road. Yeah, absolutely. And, and Alcorn, they've won, but they haven't won emphatically in their ball games this year. But they're trying to 